Uh, our first product for this week is this Alpro Soy Cream and it is the light version. So this is a, a cream for people who can't have cream essentially. It's a, a non-dairy cream product uh, and this one being light is actually really good in terms of the things that we would look at in cream which is mainly saturated fat, uh, it's brilliant, it's a lot better than cream would be, there's only 0.7 grams of saturated fat in per 100 grams in here, uh, and 298 kilojoules, so that's a lot, lot less than you get with a dairy cream, uh, and it obviously is good for people who cannot have dairy. Uh, it would be a good alternative if you were cooking and wanted to um, avoid using obviously dairy cream but also if you were not able to use light evaporated milk which we do sometimes recommend in our healthy food guide recipes so yeah if you're dairy free give this one a try here we have a new addition to the stock section in the supermarket this is Simon Galt uh, concentrated stocks and they have got some cutesy names like it's a farmers market worth of veggies in a pouch which obviously it isn't, I'm not sure I love the names. This one is the chicken stock, it's got called Don't Be Chicken, use this stock. But anyway, um, essentially it's a concentrated stock product, so it's really similar to the Continental Stock Pot, uh, and it's comparable in terms of uh, the things that we look for in stock, which is normally sodium. It's quite similar to those ones, to that product, uh, and slightly less sodium in fact in these, which is good. Uh, and they have, you know, good ingredients in them, things that you recognise, all that kind of thing. Um, it has this vegetable one, and vegetable stocks always tend to have more sodium than the others. This one has 750 milligrams per um, 100 gram or 100 mils, uh, but that's not too awful. It is not as good as the Campbell's stock, which we showed you a few weeks ago, which was no added salt, which is really brilliant. So this is still not as good as that. However, uh, the flavour of these is, is also quite similar to the to the stock pot one. Uh, and the good thing about this is it's in this in this squeezy pouch. You can use as much or as little as you want, and then you can put the rest back into the fridge. So it keeps quite well. And we would recommend when you're using this going light, so using less than they than they say on the packet, and then you can obviously control how much salt you're getting and making it with less salt is always going to be a better option but yeah we think overall these are worth a try have a look out for them here's something that made us very happy in the healthy food guide office it is a new cheese we love cheese but as we all know it is high in saturated fat generally speaking and we don't want to be having too much of that however it's a new mainland cheese called noble cheddar and it is lower in fat and lower in saturated fat but it still has a really nice tasty flavor so we were very excited to see this uh, the fat is 25.8 grams per 100 grams so and the saturated fat is 17 uh, so it's important to remember this is not low fat it is just lower in fat and so that you would compare to an edam uh, personally, Edam's not my favourite cheese, it doesn't have a lot of flavour, and this has got a lot more flavour than Edam. So, uh, a real winner from our point of view, we love it, and we definitely think you should give it a try.